This is the Roman crew in Hackney. I think we lost friends to violence, lost their lives or, or had friends hospitalised because of violence. It's not too long that I lost a close friend that like, got, sh got shot. It took fif uh, 53 minutes for ambulance to come. They died before they made it to hospital? Basically, yeah, yeah. Before he got there, yeah. When they hear it's a black shooting, mm -hmm. they'll take forever to come. I'm gonna... A black and black crime, same thing, same day, another shooting, another black boy dead. That's the thing. That's care. why a lot of black guys do not go to the police. Yo, if you say you're from Hackney, I swear uh... they don't care. They don't care about your life. I swear them. Don't you worry for your own lives? I'm fine. Every day. I just wanna make money, live it large, and get out of here. Us. Get out of here. There's the next three brothers from Roman crew. They told me belonging to a gang is a way of protecting each other, but it means they're a target for other black youths when they stray out of their own area. Is it safe for you guys to travel to different areas, different parts of London? When, when you're with something, yeah. When you're... When you got Tommy by the yeah, side, yeah, you yeah, get yeah, me? Yeah, when yeah. Tommy... Full safe, you full safe. Tommy has a gun. You know what it is? Nowadays, everyone's got one. Everyone has got... Everyone has got a gun. That's, it's easy to get a gun, everyone has got one. These youths see Hackney as a ghetto, a place that's been abandoned by the government and the rest of society. They say the streets are dangerous and there are no jobs. The government's got to come down there and see how it is. They need to, they need to spend a day, spend a day in the hood. No, no, no. But the government would say that there are jobs out there. There are jobs out there. It's you guys and your attitudes that makes you not want to go looking for work. You're happy to be comfortable. You're happy to be lazy. You're happy to be aggressive. You're happy to be dangerous with each other. What do you say to them? That's bro? bullshit. <laughs> the government, listen, if you're watching... Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> listen, yeah? You don't know what's going on around here. Tell it's talking about you to get a job. There's kids out there that's not in school. There's kids selling drugs. There's kids busting shots. There's people rolling around in straps. Think they know. You don't know. You don't have a clue. Seriously, you don't have a clue. I witness violence every day of my life. You don't have a clue. This road is known as Murder Mile. It runs through Hackney, and in the last three years, nine people have been murdered here. I've lost, I've lost three friends, that. Like. One close, close one, that. Like. He, he got taken out, that. Like. Every day I think about him, that. Like. Why was he killed? Because of a, a beef between two, two manners that don't really get along. How was he, how was he taken out? He, he, got, he got shot a couple times. Someone rolled up on him, that like, put put a couple in him, that. Like. He, he he was young as well, like you know he's not even twenty. He never he's not even twenty yet. Drugs and poverty are a lethal combination. In Hackney, even young children sell cannabis. In the streets, it's called shotting. The risks of being violently robbed are huge. Young people, like, you got people, sh people shot in that 13, 13, 14, that like, they're not built for it, like. I've known people to, like, uh, selling, selling it, and they get robbed and stabbed up. Like, I've known certain brothers that, that uh, he's died, he's died because he was selling, selling drugs. I've seen it, like, I've seen, I've seen, I've seen bundles of money made within, like, two and a half hours. Bundles of it, which more than someone will make within a month, like mm -hmm. that's that's what's tempting. That is that's tempting. If it's there, and it's tempting. Yeah, uh, so a lot of people live for now. That's what it is. a lot of people live for now instead of down the line. A quarter of black youths are unemployed in Hackney. That's double the rate of white youth unemployment. <laughs> 